Oh, ladies and gentlemen, it is I, Dark Wolf 52, and I'm on break at work. So, um, this will be a little bit of a. I've been wanting to do a video like this for a while for anybody that's. Uh, for any of you that. There's 762 of you subscribed to me, so I'm sure some of you, if not most of you, I hope it's not a lot of you. I never hope that. But there's going to be times you go through things in life, and people. There's people that deal with depression and anxiety, like me, and some of my other friends. I won't put them out there. It's none of my business, but I do have depression and anxiety, and sometimes life can get hard, and um, I just want to put this video out there for anybody that's dealing with it, along with life stuff that's putting them more down. I just want you to know that it will get better. Just hang in there. I know that some people are going to think about, you know, suicide and don't do it because it may not seem like it at first but there are people that love and care about you and will miss you when you're gone trust me and life will get better you wouldn't know the good times if you didn't get the bad times and trust me for all you know your life might be for all you know your life I can't speak Jesus for all your life God Cut. No, this is terrible. I'm trying to be serious, but it's like I'm getting tongue twisted. It's not like I'm in a rush or anything. I'm on my break. Um, I was going to say, trust me, for all you know, in another two years, your, might, your life might turn around and get better for you. You know, look at me. You know, I've had friends that I fought with friends. They talk shit behind my back. They spread rumors that got other people to turn against me, whether it was friends, girlfriends, you name it. Yeah, that shit happens. Whether you're in high school, college, or even just at work, you got people like that, unfortunately. And don't worry, they'll get what's coming to them. They usually do. Karma's funny like that. But um, here's the thing. So, like, we're not perfect. We've made mistakes. I've made mistakes. There's times i fucked up. And I owned up to it. But then there's times they fucked up, whether it was a girlfriend or a friend. So I would call them out. They didn't like it. And then that was it. Either we would recover from it or that was it. Then you got that group of people that you thought were friends. Uh-oh, the light's about to go out. No, 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 no. Ah. Hold on. All right. And then you got those people that um, so-called friends that spread rumors and get your true friends to turn on you. Well, I can't even use that word, because to be honest with you, I'm going to be honest with you. If a girl that you're dating gets these rumors from people that were your friends or people that don't like you because they just want to make your life hell because they hate you or just are jealous of you or something, if she didn't come to you and ask you if it was true or not and get your side of the story before making a choice... She wasn't for you. Same thing with a girl that's dating a guy. If he did come to you, or even, you know, gays, you know, girl on girl, guy on guy, you know, I'm all about it. You love who you love. So, you know, if your partner didn't come to you and ask you about your side of the story before they made the decision, they weren't for you. They're lost. They didn't really love you or care for you, that means. Because if they did, they would have came to you to make sure that it, if it was true or not. Like, to get your side and take it from there. If they just turn on you and don't even confront you about it, not worth your time, trust me. You'll meet better people, believe me. I've had friends come and go. I've had girlfriends come and go. And I mean, it's been almost a year since I've had a girlfriend. So, yeah. But the last time I thought I wasn't going to get a girlfriend, it was about a year before I met another one. So, you know. Sometimes it happens. When I was in high school and college... I'm just getting them left and right. Not to brag about it, but when I'm out there working, I sometimes got them left and right. Like when I was working at McDonald's, I got them left and right too. But then there was times in college that it took almost about a couple months before I got another one or like here, you know. I had some flirts here and there, but I still don't have a girlfriend yet. But hey, I know it's going to happen. You know, every time I thought I wasn't going to get a girlfriend, same thing for you. Every time you think you're not going to get another girlfriend or another boyfriend, whether you're a girl on girl or guy on guy or girl on guy, 
or guy and girl, however you want to look at it, trust me, it may take a while sometimes. Just because you got them like that at first doesn't mean it's going to keep doing that. Just like, just because life was going good for you left and right doesn't mean you're not going to have a downtime. You can have a completely shitty year, but then the next year could be fucking amazing. And that's the, the beauty of life. You're going to have downs, but you're going to have ups. Just keep fighting. Life's going to kick you down. It's your choice to get back up or let it keep you there. Trust me, I've been there. Depression and anxiety sucks. When life's being a piece of crap, it sucks. But cherish your life. You live once, don't take it away. Because you never know when it will get better. If you end your life, for all you know, your next year would have been the beginning of something great. Could have met the girl of your dreams, the guy of your dreams. You could have fucking met new friends. A lot can happen in a year. Cherish your life. It will get better. I promise you. Hang in there. Stay strong.